was feeling you? Hello everyone, Kayla here and this is What The Kink, a natural hair channel where I share my personal hair journey and tips, tricks, and product reviews to help you with your own. This is something that is rather new to my channel, so welcome back to another, because this will not be the first, Do I Steal? So these are videos where I'm trying to see if I still like something or if I still hate something or whatever the situation is. So today it's a do I still like it and it's featuring the As I Am Hydration Elation Conditioner. This is from their classic line. Um, you guys do not see much As I Am on my channel and so getting into the kind of story of what's going on here with this product. Um, I tried this a really, 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 really crazy long time ago. I was a different person. My hair was a different being, I had different preferences, my hair was completely different, whatever. I like this and I compared it to the Mixed Chicks Deep Conditioner. You know I like Mixed Chicks Deep Conditioner. It's a very light conditioner that still gets the job done. Today in modern times, just from the ingredients alone, I probably would not pick this up just because it seems to be a heavier product. And you guys know that as I am, products tend to be heavy and so I just, it, the modern me tends to not really be into them. So. We're going to go ahead and re-experience this product. I did read the directions. It says to apply, deep condition, and then come back, apply a little water, and then detangle. So we're going to do it that way, even though that's different from my regimen. It has the classic As I Am smell. I've had several products from them in the past that smell like that. Let's go ahead and put that out of the way, and let's, let's apply. Um, okay. Off the bat not super greasy or stiff feeling. It definitely is like the conditionery feel so far. saying that I was like this is gonna be heavy or whatever I feel like this is kind of disappearing into my hair <laughs> so I really hope that when I hit it with a little bit of water because I'm still gonna apply it the same way I normally would I'm hoping that when I hit it with a little bit of water that this kind of like like I don't know I don't know how to describe it but like better coats my hair and kind of I feel the presence of it which some products that does happen when I apply water and then hopefully I won't feel like I need to add a little bit more because right now, as it exists, like I know that I would probably add more product to this. Um, plus, I'm going to go deep condition with it. So it's not it's going to be a little bit dry, which, of course, they did see that happening and they said to add water. So we'll see. Um, but let me add a tap of water to see if I can like get a different feel. OK. It's not increasing the slippery feeling, honestly. Um, and I think that's due to the fact that the fatty alcohols in this product are not super high. Like they're not like at the top of the ingredients list. I loosened some shit hair with that, but um, I'm not feeling like the product is doing more um, with water added. just thought about it I'm probably not going to be able to do this sectioning like this because I'm not going to fit under the the plastic cap's not going to fit on my head so let me just do both the front and the back with a little bit more product and then I'll do like a flat roll situation to kind of to ensure that I will fit the plastic cap so take this back Roll it, roll it, and then hopefully clip it in place, but it's probably going to loosen up. I'm not really good at doing this. Okay, and then we'll tap the water on the other side and do the same thing. I 
know, it's just feeling like there's no product on here. Like we want it to be light, but not non-existent. Okay. And then we'll do the back. Section, I, I sectioned my hair after I got from under there to make it easier to organize myself. Um, as I was sectioning, I will say I did start to feel the presence of the conditioner a little bit better. <laughs> uh, as opposed to when I first actually um, put it on there. I really was not feeling that. So I'm going to go ahead and detangle one for you guys on camera. And we'll talk about the experience. But the directions say to add a little bit more water. So we'll do that. The water is probably not that warm. So... <laughs> Squeeze it in there, squeeze it in there. All right. And clip it. I do have shed hairs that are coming off on my hands like already. So let's get in there. I mean, I'm able to detangle my hair. Like, that's cool. I feel a little bit of stuff going on at the end. So we'll spend a little time there. Yeah, like now I do more so feel the presence of the conditioner. Um, it's definitely feeling a little bit more heavy or whatever. So maybe it just needs to be heat activated like um, to get it to be more doing something. But I'm not someone who deep conditions with heat. Um, like I was hating that experience <laughs> the entire time I was under there. <sighs> It's, it's, it's the water dripping, the inconvenience of getting out of the shower. That's really what it is. It's, I'm, I'm, I'm not being tortured. Um, first world problems. Okay, so I'm just hangling through it easy. And I feel like the ease, though, is kind of due to the fact that this is kind of a heavier conditioner. Um, it has slipped. Um, in, that, in that as I am way, because as I am just tends to have heavier products so now it does feel like your typical as I am product as I brush through it get a little closer you can see like it no <laughs> I you thought I was feeling you no um I, honestly y'all I feel like it, it did what it was supposed to do I can say that I was able to put it in detangle whatever I was supposed to do um but I feel like it did not have the slip that I'm used to unless like I had to add heat I add, I had to add that extra bit of water after I had um uh deep conditioned um, it felt like water when I was putting it in. I feel like I use a smidge more product than I would normally use of a typical 8 ounce um, conditioner. I'll show you guys. Some of you guys are like, what do you mean? But I know how much I typically use and this is just a slight bit more than what I would typically use. So that's here. So um, I'm going to finish it. It wasn't horrible. It didn't pull my hair out or anything, but I was like, eh. And then upon the rinse out, it just feels like absence of conditioner. Like, I don't really feel like it, you know, I, I don't feel that, that great about it. So, um, and I think it's just because the fatty alcohols are just not as far up as I like when I use conditioner. So this is it. Um, I could pass on this one. I could definitely pass on this one. <laughs> 